And still, with all this ridiculous naval leverage, the Ironborn make no demands or attempts at taking what they came for by force, strongly going against their culture. Also, since they already figured out that Daenerys' fleet will land at Dragonstone, why didn't Cersei just ask Euron to go there and destroy her whilst they had the chance? And even if Euron had failed, he would have weakened Daenerys at no cost to Cersei, as well as weakened the Iron Fleet enough to not rise up against the Lannisters anytime soon. 